all by machine. With this method, you can form each window with only three seams. If you don't have much time, this is a method that will allow you to build the windows completely by machine. Uh, you will only need five squares of fabric to make a window frame and you can sew this block together to finish your project. Note that the base squares uh, can be built in any way. You can even use your assembly blocks to frame the window. You can apply the window by machine and quilt the entire project. Let's see how to do it. Pieces. Preparing the muslin. Check the cutting techniques section to learn how to prepare the fabric before cutting. Prepare the muslin so that it is straight and without the selvage. Press well. Maybe add a little starch to make it easier to stack several layers of fabric in one stack. Check that the edges are lined up and that you are not missing fabric in any of the layers. Block. This is where you cut for the window frame and fold it in half right side out. Place two of the base square right side facing and each of the folded edge of the frame. So along this edge at a quarter of an inch. Repeat the process with the other side. Now take the two new parts of the frame and fold it perpendicularly out. Now up the previous seams in the center. Go along next to the seam. Open and align the intersection in the center. In the seam section, you have more information. You can join several of these blocks until you do the plot. Now that the base square can be built in any way, you can even use your assembly blocks to frame the window. And you can use rectangles too. You can also apply the windows by machine and quit the entire project. Application Window Templates Cutting Prepare the templates and cut the pieces of fabric. Remember that you don't have the seam allowance for the windows. The edges are wrapped in the frame when applied. Place the fabric inside the window frame and secure it with a pin. Fold the fabric of the frame over the edge of the window fabric. Straighten to form the window frame. You can sew it by machine or by hand. Now, check the apply in the window section for step-by-step -step instructions. Get ready for the project. To analyze the practice, you can use the table practice with muslin that you will find in the resources section. Take note that, uh, of each aspect, whether or not you achieved your goal, uh, the level of difficulty you experienced, and the time it took to do it. Analyze the process and see if you need more practice. Take note of the points where you have struggled and consider what changes you could make to overcome them. With all the information you have, you can now complete the time management table for your project. Check the resources section for more information. Read the tutorial instructions carefully and identify the different stages. Visualize each task based on your practice with Muslim spirits. Assign schedule according to your daily routine and start little by little gradually incorporating these new activities. Choose the duration of each task so that you can perform it and according to your experience in practice. If it takes you an hour to complete the block, for example, don't give the task a half an hour duration. Take into account the stages that you have found difficult in practice. Consider repeating the practice before starting the project. If not, keep this in mind and pay more attention when doing the task. Now, go to the project section and let's get started.